just putting this random clip here because I'm about to do a COVID test because I have been coughing nonstop and I don't know, I feel fine. It's just the cough that I've been having and I unfortunately was in contact with two people at my work that had COVID. <sighs> I'm gonna do the test right now. I'm gonna do an at-home test. Flowfax or Flowflex. I got three of them just so I can keep at home and then my husband's gonna do one too, so I got four. Never done a freaking at-home test. Well, hopefully all goes well and I can do this. Thank you, God! Salio negativo! COVID free! I ain't gonna lie, I was very nervous. It came out negative. Oh my god, don't worry, I, t I did wash my hands. I've been eating, I was eating sushi, but oh my god, it, it says negative. Oh my god, I'm so happy. I was looking nervous because my boss and one of the doctors tested positive um, last week and this week, and I was very, in, a lot, like, in contact with them. And I still feel coffee, so that what I, I bought some medicine. I bought some robitucin which is really good for the cough and the chest so i'm gonna be drinking this until i feel a little better because i still feel like i cough not a lot but i do have a weird cough i just got home from work i guess i can start my intro as i am getting ready but i just got home it is friday january 28th last weekend before february approaches already can you believe that we're in freaking february hi guys welcome back to another vlog i'm gonna do a weekend in my life vlog figured that the days that i'm off the weekends that my husband is off we can do weekend in my life vlogs if we're doing fun stuff i guess we don't have a lot planned we're probably gonna go to the movies tomorrow or sunday there's this movie that we both want to watch that's coming out or that recently came out i think so we're gonna do that and then today i'm getting ready literally three o'clock just doing something super simple in my face because i want i'm gonna do my nails and i was like you know what i would like to look a little bit presentable if i'm gonna get my nails done you know i, I want to look i don't want to look like shit i just thought it would be cute if we just did a little a little get ready with me because i'm just gonna do a time lapse as i'm getting ready but i just wanted to come in and say hey welcome back to another vlog but i figured i would vlog me um getting ready so and start the vlog right now so like that you guys are not confused and i'm not running late but yeah my appointment is in about an hour so i'm gonna hurry up i got about 30 minutes a little bit less than 30 minutes for me to get ready so i can head out because i want to head out like earlier than normal because i don't want to be stuck in traffic traffic and i i just we don't clash very good <laughs> sorry guys my battery died so let's continue My battery died and my camera clearly i wasn't prepared to do a weekend in my life vlog at least but i'm on my way to my nails this is what i did for my uh makeup literally super simple i said i wasn't gonna go all out i'm gonna do my nails i'm gonna insert a picture here of something like kind of similar to what i want i want to do like white french nails probably some really cute hearts probably i'm gonna do for valentine's day also i did these and a lot of people thought that I did them, like at a nail, like like at a nail salon, and I was like, no, I didn't. But kudos to me, you know, that I was able to do that. I'm running a little late, but I'm literally not rushing. I don't like to rush when I'm on the road. If you know me, you know I don't rush. At this point, I used to rush, and that just one, it messes up your car because you're taking all a whole bunch of oil, acelerando el cantazo, like speeding, like acelerando el carro demasiado. So I'm just not gonna. I'm gonna be chill, super chill about it. I'm just gonna go slowly, you know. Plus, it's traffic time, and I'm pretty sure she will understand that I'll be running a few minutes late. But also, 
I know I'm on the middle of the road, but driving, but I wanted to say that I got new glasses. I got my glasses in, if you guys remember, I did mention it in one of my Puerto Rico vlogs that I was gonna get new glasses. And they came in and this is how they look. They look so cute. But yeah, they're like a light lavender color. Definitely tend to feel and look like clear and you know, colors like that. It tends to look clear sometimes, but they are a little bit bigger than the other ones. I do plan on getting other kinds of glasses this year. I want to have at least two or three um, like round ones that I could probably play around with or wear. I cannot drive or go anywhere without my glasses anymore. I cannot see without my glasses unless I decide to do eye surgery and fix these babies up. But I don't want to do that yet because tell you why we do plan on having babies within the next year or two we plan we would like and we're open to potentially me being us being pregnant and um, bringing a baby to the family oh my god I'm putting this out there that's like crazy people are gonna be like okay it's been a year so what's going on <laughs> like a year later after I said this I'm turning 25 this year so I I would like to start um, opening, having a mindset of having a a baby. Um, because of that, I don't want to do eye surgery yet because apparently you either well, on your pregnant when you're pregnant, you either you lose like your vista gets a little worse, like your your eye gets a little worse, or I don't know what it is. But yeah, I want to wait till I have at least my first child depends what happened i don't know why i'm talking about babies right now in the middle of the road on my way to my nails appointment <laughs> but yeah guys i will update you guys a little bit later I was planning on putting them away, but I guess I don't have time, so. But yeah, I love my nails. I did definitely, usually when I do them this shape, the almond shape, I don't go super, super long. Um, I did went a little bit extra longer than what I do them. I like to do them like small and delicate. I didn't want to really bother her with what was done to ask her to get them shorter. I'm sure it's fine. And besides, I really like how the whole design and everything looks. And I'm just glad to have my nails back. I feel like myself again, you know? Um, I did want to say a little bit of what I have planned this week Weekend, but I would like to say when I'm in better lighting so I'll either say it tomorrow or I will talk to you guys a little later tonight I'm probably my plans tonight is just to chill I wanted to have a little bit of sangria but unfortunately I do not have I cannot drink because I woke up with a little bit of migraine headaches I've been having some migraine headaches lately I think I'm gonna be that girl that suffers from migraines getting home now my husband apparently already had dinner um, he usually has very late lunch as of lately so I just gotta figure out what I'm gonna have to eat for dinner I don't know but I don't want McDonald's I don't want fast food so I think I'm gonna end up buying some uh, sushi I'm rambling so I'm gonna let you guys go I will update you guys a little later guys remember when I said that I was gonna get sushi and not McDonald's yeah I got McDonald's <laughs> guys I made it home I ate had McDonald's yeah roll that clip again I got McDonald's after I said I wasn't gonna have McDonald's I had McDonald's anyways I'm gonna watch some Discovery Plus while I put the groceries away because I still have not done that
pick up more. size and I ordered the small size. I've been out since 9, no, like 10 a.m. I would say. When I looked at my phone, it was 10 something, so. But I'm so tired. I'm about to answer all of my morning messages that I have. I don't know what's going on um, but like my my forehead hurts I don't know if it's because I've been used like on the computer all day at work and I've been playing here too so I've been using my computer but I don't know anyways I ordered a keyboard for my computer and it arrives today I ordered it yesterday I Amazon primed it so I'm excited for that because I've been into playing sims again so I am excited because I am gonna see if I can unbox it with you guys and we can try it it's really cute it's pink and it's very pretty I've been into like pinky pastel kind of colors lately I would like to get eventually a pair of headphones and maybe a cute mouse that i could use i don't mind my mouse right now i really like it my husband gave it to me it's one of his old mouses that he used to use so he's got a few that he has yeah i'm gonna go get some food some lunch i think i'm gonna go for wendy's and i'm gonna get myself some mcdonald's <laughs> i don't know what's wrong with me guys my husband's tired of mcdonald's and I was tired of it, and now I'm back on the grind and buying McDonald's. That's how I am. When I'm obsessed with something, I eat it every single day after I get McDonald's sick. Like, that's just how I am. He literally, before I left the door, he was like, don't get McDonald's.
food is secured. I'm almost home. I'm literally like a few seconds away. I don't think we're gonna go out today because he wants to see a movie at home. He doesn't want to go to the movies. And I kind of don't want to go out. Um, it's really not cold. It's so sunny that it doesn't feel cold outside. So I wouldn't have minded going out, but it's okay. I think we're gonna go out tomorrow when it's even colder. <laughs> Yeah, I am home now, so I will update you guys a little later and we'll do a little unboxing of my new keyboard. It says it should arrive around 2 o'clock-ish, 6, and it's currently 12.25 right now. I'm excited and I will update you guys a little later. God, how is it freezing? So our day has been pretty chill today. Let me let down my hair and look at least somewhat presentable because I've literally been looking like shit today. Ain't gonna lie. I still have to test out my Revlon hairbrush a little better. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong, but the hair doesn't last me like a whole week. I don't know if it's because I'm passing more blower than the actual like straightener. So that's why, because when I go to the beauty salon, they always pass more straightener than the blower. No, it's the other way, but I guess she has her own techniques. But for some reason, it hasn't been working for me, clearly, as you guys can tell. Anyways, I literally did my hair last week, so I like to keep it for like a whole week. That's how my hair, I guess, sits somewhat. It doesn't damage from the heat that much. And if you wash it a lot, it's not healthy for your hair either. If you constantly wash it so i wash it every week and a half i would say probably in the middle of next week i'm probably gonna wash it but these next few days i'm probably gonna be curling it and styling it that way with curls anyways we've had a pretty chill day i cleaned wrote down some stuff in my planner and put and added some stickers as, as you guys saw and i got my new keyboard which i have not tested it out yet it feels very nice and aesthetically very ASL. Smart. like the sound i like mechanical keyboards something about mechanical keyboards just hit different from regular keyboards i like the the tapping noises and everything and the sounds and this one for some reason is not super loud like mechanical keyboard i used to have one the white one that i used to have that was like colorful was way too loud for me like you can live it sounded like a typewriter <laughs> and this one is like subtle and like it has that mechanical like tapping sound but it's not like super loud at all. It's like perfect and I love it. I'm glad I got it like that because I was nervous. I was like, I hope it's not super loud. I don't like the ones that are like sound like an actual typewriter. <laughs> I am heading to Cheddar's. Um, if you guys have a local Cheddar's, you guys know. I'm a huge fan of the appetizer, the espinaca con with the chips. Oh my God, that hits 
different. It's delicious. I absolutely love it. We ordered like a full meal there and we also ordered that and dessert. I'm excited because I ordered, <laughs> I'm being too loud, sorry. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm excited because I ordered some, the cookie dessert with the chocolate and the vanilla ice cream. Oh my God, I'm excited to devour that. We're gonna eat and then I'm gonna probably play a little bit. I didn't vlog yesterday me playing, so I think I'm gonna vlog today because my camera died and I was charging both batteries, so that's why I didn't charge it. I didn't vlog that yesterday because I wanted to charge both cameras so I can just vlog the whole day of today. I'm gonna go get the food, so and then we're gonna come back and I'm gonna play. I have not been feeling my best, like, like my back has been killing me today. Yeah, I don't know why because I have not cleaned or done some well no I did I know from what it's from yesterday I threw away like a huge like trash bag and it was so heavy so I did not want to wait for my husband because it's, it was too overflowing and it was giving me anxiety but I was just like I'm just gonna do it myself also something that I have noticed I don't know if you guys remember but last year one of my cons of 2021 was that I hurt my arm and I had JSO for like a few weeks and I started my year not great and since last year like end of last year kind of November mid-November December and then this year this month I my arm has been hurting again and like it hurts when I like when someone taps it or like goes like that or pokes it and I don't know if it has to do with that I don't know I think I'm gonna go see my doctor for my migraine headaches and for my arm and see if everything's okay I was not the process of healing after I took my gesso off it was good but like two months after I started just lifting stuff and it was not great for my arm so I don't know if that messed it up or if it did something I hope it didn't let's go ahead and get cheddars I'm excited That car was going fast. That tree scared me. I look at it in the camera and I thought my, my window was cracked. I was like, what the heck just happened? I am playing some Sims. I guess this is gonna be more of a chill vlog because I am, we're really, we didn't go out today. Um, we're not going out tomorrow. We don't have plans unless we go to the movies like we were planning on doing it today. We shall see what happens, but I don't know. I will say I am playing some Sims. I've been playing for about half an hour, I would say, maybe less. And I'm trying to make a really cute Asian uh, Sim. I have not made an Asian yet and I've been really into this like Asian blogger that has, I don't remember her name, but she plays Sims and she does a lot of Let's Play, sharing her mods and things like that. So I've been, I got inspired and I was like, oh my God, I totally did not realize that I had not made an Asian Sims. And I'm gonna put her in a really cute apartment that I just designed, literally super small, one bedroom and one bath and just a basic kitchen and living area and an office space. I guess I can give you guys a tour after I'm done, but I figured I would do a little time lapse of me playing. So yeah, as you guys saw, I did. I've been playing around with my keyboard. I thought it would like, I don't know why I thought it would turn on, but I don't mind it not turning on. I thought it had like LED like lights or something, but it doesn't. It only has turns on a light in the corner if the battery is running low because it is wireless but other than that no it doesn't have any more lights but i don't mind it um i'm also i don't know if you guys can see but i am currently strapped in my back strap 
thing. I have not used this in a while. I think it's been a few months and I was so happy and excited that I hadn't used it, but I had to take it out. Yesterday I took out the trash and my husband was like, don't do it, it's too heavy. Um, just wait till I get home. Did not wait till he got home and that messed everything up. It messed up my back so bad. But while I'm doing that, I'm just watching some YouTube videos, catching up with some of my YouTube bloggers i've had a chill night we had dinner it was good it wasn't the best i tried these like grilled sh shrimps and they were very spicy they were good but they were just very spicy and i did not fully enjoy them because i was just thinking about how spicy they were but it was good otherwise other than that flavor wise it was really really good i i really liked it a lot i'm gonna be playing here i'm gonna show you guys the like what I do and all that stuff and how I designed this sim. Oh, also, the reason why it's so silent in my house, my husband went out with his guy friends and they w went out for drinks. So that's why the house feels so quiet, which is weird. I'm not used to this. It just, they haven't, he hasn't gone out in a while. And the reason why is because he does not like wearing the mask. And in order for him not to wear the face mask, he doesn't go out because he doesn't want to get sick and get COVID. So we've been very like taking this COVID to a whole other level, I would say. Look how cute she is. I just randomized the sim down here and it just popped up that whole thing. This is a good thing about CC, you guys. I just, I like it, it looks cute. Let's see if I can put like smaller eyes and see how she looks. That was cute. In order to like see better her face, I just get like a hairstyle that's like all sleek back so I can adjust her face and then I would change her hair. Anyways guys, I've been rambling and just talking a whole bunch of stuff. So I'm just gonna put you guys somewhere around here so that we can keep designing this. you guys a little tour of the apartment because i'm gonna move them in to that apartment so i'm literally gonna leave her with just two thousand dollars i'm obviously gonna use a little cheat code and just put her in with give her a little bit of money maybe like a few bucks so i give her fifty two thousand dollars so like fifty two thousand um dollars extra i can give you guys a quick tour and when you walk in sorry guys i suck at this you have like this mini hallway where it has the bedroom and the bathroom and a, some cute like quotes framed on the wall and then we have a mini dining room and then here i have her kitchen which i have a fun fact about this kitchen i saw this kitchen wait how can i put this in a way where you guys can actually see i saw this kitchen in fixer upper <laughs> in the new series welcome home i saw like this whole aesthetic like the green with the wood um island and i thought it was so cute so i created it myself it looks so pretty i love how it looks she's cute and she's like small but like perfect i should put like a i'm gonna put a countertop 
like right here in the esquina because it makes no sense to like not have one here anyways let's continue this haul i mean <laughs> this tour and then so there's a kitchen and then she has a really cute small food bowl thing for the cat and then in front of the kitchen we have the whole living room situation i made a very like boho aesthetic type of style i really wanted to hang the tv but we couldn't because of the window and there was windows everywhere and if you know and you play sims you know you cannot edit the windows and the doors in the apartment complex uh world where the all the apartments are so yep it is what it is i just put it like that and i hung up I just put the TV there. On this side, we have the office area, which is where she gets all her inspo and writing book and all that jazz, which she does. Um, we should get her a job. Let's see if she can, if we can do that really quickly. And then back to the hallway. We're gonna go into her bedroom and then her bathroom. Well, let's go to the bathroom first. So I don't know how I'm gonna show you guys this with the whole walls up. Very small bathroom. I think I'm just gonna have to put it small like this because I don't have another option. Sorry, you guys. But this is how the bathroom looks. Really cute, small and simple. I have two mirrors, a cute sink, a wooden sink. It looks really pretty. Some wall decor. It says XOXO. We have the shower and a cute rack for all the towels and stuff. So yeah and then her bath her bedroom is right here looks really cute has just a simple nightstand a cute small bed for the cat i did not hang anything here i think this is gonna this is just a basic wall accent like accent wall with a shiplap i think that's called i don't know <laughs> and then here on the other side we have like the, her dresser and a like single chair couch situation and then some really cute wall frames and then we have like this is literally the only store she has to just save her clothes the poor girl so no walk-in closet it's kind of boring but it's okay and then she has a mirror she can take her ottd pictures and yeah that's pretty much it it's pretty small and simple but it's cute i got her a job as a writer assistant but she's gonna eventually get promoted and actually write books which is great the apartment complex that i actually used was this one right here the jasmine suites apartment complex i used this side if you guys were interested i don't know hope you guys enjoyed that take a break on vlogging yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this little portion of playing sims started a new pill a new monthly pill i know this is when the nausea starts it's always the first week and a half which really sucks how that happened because if it wasn't for that like my hormones and everything like have been really really good knock on wood the past few months so it's just the nausea if it wasn't for that i would have been like okay. not i would have confidently taken the pills anyways my battery's flashing let me switch this camera up It is the next day. It's Sunday. I have not vlogged until now. We have literally done nothing. Just clean. I did laundry. Other than that, nothing else. Literally. I also cooked and made some hot dogs. Puerto Rican style. Con carne, papi de ketchup. It was delicious. And now I'm playing Sims until I get tired. It's currently almost 10 p.m. I should be going to sleep around probably 11 because I'm really not tired. I'm gonna do a little time lapse of me just playing. I thought we were gonna do stuff today, but I guess we didn't, so it's fine. I'm just gonna go ahead and a time lapse of me playing. And then I think I'm gonna close the vlog here. I'll try my best to make. I will be vlogging next weekend, um, hopefully. Um, we'll see because I have to, f I wanna film like a few sit down videos, so I might focus on that if I don't do a vlog. We'll see what happens.